So this is the DC fuse, which is going to the truck, which blows when D2 comes on. That you mark everything before you remove it so you know which wire goes where. I obviously know this will go here, this wire will go over there and this bar, bus bar, is going to the fuse, goes on the bottom too. So you know your diode current is flowing this way so it comes from here and it flows onto the bus bar and then goes there. It shouldn't short circuit now. To test this rectifier, it's got a diode flying from here to there and there to there. We should have current. Put this on meter on diode test. Test this. That's fine. Should be open circuit, which it is. Test this one. And that goes into closed circuit. And that goes into closed. So that's short circuited there. Let's test the new one. There. Should be nothing on the other side, yep. And there, and should be nothing on the other side, yep. So that's a good one. This one, one side is blown. Let's put a new one on and see what happens. Okay, we've got power now. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna leave the mains off. We're just gonna connect it to the forklift and see if it blows that fuse. If it's short circuit, it will blow the fuse. If it's okay, it won't. I'm gonna turn the power on. It's 48 volts, 70 amp hour, L200, it's still on. Okay, I'm about to turn it on and it should go on to charging. Turn it on. It's going on to charging, two minutes before it comes in. 